Uh, I'm 154 and I have minus four in the appendix. Uh, usually I'm, I'm too short for the boulders that are being set in the gyms that I climb in. Yeah, I'm super excited to see what he's gonna set for us today. But it's really fun because both like Vivi and Julia climb really well, but they have quite different styles as well. So I'll say like I want to try and set something that will challenge them both in a little bit of different ways so that they can really like shine in their own styles. Yeah, I'm just super excited. You can see how big I'm smiling. <laughs> I just want to go and climb it right now. I think I might have a bit more trouble because I'm quite bad at reading roots. So I'm probably just going to try and power through it and see how it goes. <laughs> So you start, two big holds, some heel hooks, just really comfortable, get into the problem. And then you have this big volume feature that you go in, do some compression, activate the biceps a little bit, and then start utilizing some toe hooks. And then you pull on to the, um, this head wall feature, and then it's gonna be more delicate compression, and then more heel hooks, and then like a last dynamic move. So the middle section is really made to suit Yulia because the box is tiny, so she should fit really, really well. And then the last move is a little bit more for Vivi, um, so that they both have spots where they can shine, but I think that should suit them pretty well. So we'll see, it's, I think it felt like a good level. So it might make it a little bit harder depending on how it feels for them. <laughs> yeah, be cool to see how it goes. Yeah, yeah the holds, I believe these are kilter holds yes. that I've never climbed on before. But when I saw Nick and set this boulder, I smiled the entire time because I can see that this is like completely my style and I feel super comfortable on crimps. Uh, so it's very obvious that he had me in mind when setting this and also Vivi. Yeah, I'm just super excited. You can see how big I'm smiling. <laughs> I just want to go and climb it right now. <laughs> uh, no, let's see if I flash it or not. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Thumbs crossed. <laughs> Thumbs crossed. the knee okay yeah my knee is fine oh, that was a good try i think yeah Whew. too bad i got i took my knee and got a bit stuck and if you're probably gonna see me like fumble around quite a bit and just like trying to really flash it but uh we'll see um yeah i'm just gonna give it a go and see okay see how it goes <laughs> Cheeky knee bar. Oh, I think I forgot about like a foot somewhere. It felt really flowy, which was nice. Although it might might not have <laughs> not have looked that way, <laughs> but <laughs> It did, uh, yeah, so Julia says that it did, so I'm happy about that, but yeah, I think I need to figure out how to to go to the second to last hold with a bit more control. So, what am I doing now? <laughs> I I'm gonna... trying the middle part. Yeah, where you fell, no? Yeah, where I fell. I got stuck a bit with my knee, so I'm gonna try, I think I'm gonna try and do the same thing. Yeah. 
Yeah, so now I tried two different betas. One that was Nikken's intended beta, which was to put the heel hook on the uh, green volume. But that was pretty hard. It could work, but it, it was kind of hard. But I think there might be an easier beta, and that is to put the heel hook on the the side pull that's on the box. So I'm gonna try and see how that works, I guess. <laughs> I could feel my right hand starting to glide off. Okay. Okay, so now mo me, both me and Julia are stuck on the same move and it's getting to the second to last hold. And um, I was thinking maybe if it's possible to put, because I really like high steps and high heels, if I could get uh, a left heel on the left hand and maybe just try and lock it off. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I don't think that's gonna work. <laughs> Even for me, that's a pretty high heel and it's not like a super juggy heel as well. So I think I'll just have to do the intended beta and try really hard. <laughs> way better okay I can do it now <laughs> I hope Finally figured the move out Yes. and this time I was focusing on like getting a bit higher up and then when I tried to catch the right hold I pulled a lot more to the right and that was the key. How are you feeling baby? I'm feeling kind of nervous actually. I really want to send it. Uh, so I've done all the moves but I think it's going to be a bit harder when you're doing it from the bottom. Mm -hmm. So I guess I'll just have to pull through. And up for the best. Come on. <laughs> no! I slipped somewhere, I don't know where, but I slipped. Oh, damn it. <sighs> so the start isn't necessarily that hard, but there's just so many ways of doing it, which makes it easy to, to forget your beta. And it, I tend to spend a lot of time trying to remember what beta I did. And then I waste a lot of energy uh, on the first couple of moves. Yeah, I, I use the knee bar yeah to, to lock off to to um, to the other crimp because they're quite good but they're blocked so you can't just like throw for them you have to be kind of precise okay so I found like a cheeky little knee bar uh, between the volumes so they aren't necessarily that hard but there are probably better ways of doing it um, or like more efficient ways uh, and you want to do it efficient because the crux is kind of almost at the end 
once you go for like the the second to last hold you really need to have like tension and power and be quite precise with your foot placement um, so that's the tricky part about that is like keeping the tension after the first couple of moves and then the end is a jump which is nice <laughs> yeah Okay, so now I figure out all the moves. Uh, and as Vivi said, it's like, it's gradually getting harder and harder the more you climb. Because when you get to the middle part, that's when you need to be quite strong and be very precise where you place your hands and stuff. Yeah, that's the part when I get really, really tired. So that's why it's really key to like, save the energy in the start. And do the jump around, that's fine or listen, like Yeah, it usually it's fine. But I did try it one more time where I completely fell off from it. Uh, it's still like a, you can still fr fall from the last move. <laughs> so I'll give it my go and see and hopefully I'll send. Come on Julia! <laughs> <laughs> Happen. Uh, I guess I didn't, uh, or I missed the hold. But when you catch it, you you really hold it. But if you don't catch it, you won't. <laughs> yeah. Easier today. Oh, I felt so strong in my crimps too today. Oh, I'm happy I got got that one away. I wanted to send it up that bad that I overshot the the jug with like a decimator it felt like but felt so good to day flash it thanks for the uh, for the professional brushing <laughs> from the crew <laughs> Performed as it's supposed to. Yes. <laughs> Eric's like, thank you. <laughs> Lincoln does his job.